and welcome to the ULI Podcast, a podcast dedicated to your satisfaction. This is episode 69. I'm Brian. This is Chris. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. you like that? This is your favorite pothead, Sir D. Sir D. And like any other week, we are back here on the W Ball. Who's ready to get it? We're going to have a good time. Talk about everything we saw on these timelines. And some of this shit is heavy while we're in the show. It's episode 69. <laughs> DJ E. Z. <Z-D>. Dick. Um, <laughs> Sherman, tell them what topic you got. Well, being that this is episode 69, mm. we are planning on fulfilling all of your uh, <laughs> fan- fantasy needs in these subjects. And hope y'all tune in for a special <laughs> third topic where we going to get down to the knee. Yeah, we might have to put that on Patreon. Angry. Sorry, guys. But uh, first, I'm going to talk about Kyle Rittenhouse. Yeah. Because that needs to be... Uh, Disgust. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, and we also gonna bring around uh, Astro Astro World and the tragic events that happened there and the conspiracy. The yeah. 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 There's a lot to put Involved together there. I, that. I think it's gonna be you, Eliza, Galore on that one. Yeah, so. and, and then the third topic, yeah. I, I, I sprinkled something on Brian early on, and you will lie on the fly. Yeah, this one upset. Me. This one upset me, man. I, you know, you can you can feel it in your balls, literally. Yeah, we're like, gonna talk about man. little male contraceptives mm-hmm. and, and how that's gonna look in the future going oh, forward. My God. Yeah. So y'all, and, and you know when we talk about these topics. Uh, if we, anybody on this panel was is obligated to get called out or you know put on the table, called out for their BS. Anybody, anybody can. And those yeah. punishments are going to be the shot, which my good brother Maury here yeah, that's great. has one ready. Oh, you know, yeah. his topic didn't no make topic. the cut. No topic. I didn't even have a topic. No, no topic time made the cut. Yeah. Sometimes <laughs> blame me. Sometimes you just got to take the shot. So that we can talk, talk Astro World. That that yeah. that'll get him going for the for the for episode. The you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So you got the, the punishment with the shot. You also got I the ten dollar cash app to eight oh five ENT. Y'all while you playing. And then also to stay ready. Stay ready. Stay ready. Push up. Yeah, stay ready. ready, you might as well go sleep, might go on a cruise, man. No, you know what I'm saying? We you know what I'm saying? If you stay ready. You gotta get ready. And then we all gonna be uh out there with <laughs> shit. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, if I got something to say about it, I hope we're, yeah, I hope so, man. I'm trying to I'm trying to pick, shed the weight off of b- uh, both these niggas. Man. We about to be walking out. around for real. With the pecs out, new bra sizes. Mm-hmm. <laughs> speak on it. Speak on it. You know, I've earned a cup, you know. I've earned a cup. I've earned a cup. But a continuity. Continuity. Y'all niggas tripping. All right, man. Yeah, and we're going to get in. We're going to get into it right now. All right, here we go. Uh, I guess technically this is my subject. Uh... Uh, you know, uh, things that have been circulating in the man o sphere, as I call it, you know, 1834, at least everybody's interested in this. It pops up. You, you either saw it in passing or maybe you were obsessed with big it. Story. But uh, Travis Scott had a big concert. I don't even know what it was called, to be the, honest the with Astro you. World I only saw the Astro Festival. Festival. The Astro Festival or Astro the Music World Festival. Festival, something like that. Yeah, well, it's what it's was called it called? called Astro World. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Yeah, uh, I, I can stand on Astro World. Yeah. It was a music festival. I don't know what it was not, called. Not just a concert. It was like a music yeah. festival. So, you know, he, but, yeah, the no. thing is, it, it's one of the probably one of the biggest events he's ever put on, and I would think in the light of everything that's happened, the thirst for that kind of event could create some some kind of the fervor. COVID pandemic and all yeah yeah the yeah yeah and, yeah, yeah all of that so when you having a giant event like everybody just want to be there and it was crazy speaking like, of being there why was there 10 year old and 8 year old kids there they follow him yeah he has a big following Wait, 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 let's get yeah, to yeah, the, wait, yeah, wait, because I don't, I don't know anything about that, to be honest with you. Wait, let him finish. Yeah, to be honest with you, I'm probably never going to frame the subject. Yeah, I don't know about 10-year-olds. I might call you out on that. Go ahead. On. Go ahead. <laughs> no, I'm not go going ahead. to. Anyway. You <laughs> <laughs> said feel that come up. Okay, so, so uh, yeah, people were, like, knocking over fences and trampling each other to get into this shit. The concert was completely <clears throat> sold out. At how many thousands was it? 50,000? So it was a lot, a lot of people. A lot of people in the thing. It was yeah, it was one of them things where if you've ever been to a be, uh, to an event, one time I have been where it was to it literally concert? packed wall to, to wall a concert. To uh, yeah. I think we did. Uh, what was that in Vegas that we went to where it was wall to wall? I got the fuck out of there. I was drunk. Oh, that was uh, the DJ Khaled thing. Come on, last week. No, 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 no. no. This was years ago. This was years ago. 
Now we, you, but you were there. there. You were there. Yeah, we went right. to this yeah. event. That was a DJ Khaled oh, one. Yeah, yeah. The towel. The Nigga, towel. It was packed that wall was, yeah, that to was wall in yeah. there, and I can imagine. Can you imagine that the concert, an that event? Can you imagine yeah, what? Up, can yeah. you imagine that? What we went through times like a hundred, times like a thousand, like that many people there trampling each other. Crowd size. So that's what happened at this concert. It was shit popping off. There is a lot of other, you know, little uh, little theories that bloom from this, but li- but people die. Nine confirmed deaths. Nine confirmed deaths yeah. from just people passing out up front, like and, it was uh, it trampled. About three hundred plus trampled. Mm-hmm. Yeah, three hundred. Like, oh wow. boy. Sheesh. So that Great. so basically, it, the concert was just throwing numbers around. Huh? The, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. yeah. We are, we are right now. We'll get, we'll get into it because hey, I got to I got to finish it. I gotta finish framing it, and I and I'm gonna do this. The, the concert was basically <clears throat> like, uh, can, what do you you call things natural disasters? Like like a stamp a stampede is a natural disaster, right? Isn't it? A stampede, natural disaster. If you want to call it I think natural so. from us being mammals because we're right. humans. Yeah. Well, you can't predict disaster. when you're gonna get trampled by a giant crowd of one species. That's, I mean, that's true. But yeah, no one that's not a natural Caused disaster, by though. nature, though. Yeah, yeah, that's not a natural You're lying! It's so so a natural disaster! Is it? There, a stampede is a fucking natural disaster of some sort or another. Not like yeah. bulls, right? We talking humans? Like Nobody can predict right? a stampede. All right, no one can predict out. someone getting shot either. No one can predict the DUI. Yeah, no one can predict that either. I don't know, but I'm going with uh, Stampede as a natural disaster. Yeah, you called it out. What you want for it? Uh, shit, I guess push-ups. The stay ready. Natural disaster. Is a Stampede a natural disaster? We're going to look that up. That's a natural beautiful. disaster. I like well, the this sandwich, definition. I don't know if it really a natural disaster. A That's natural, what it was. A natural Shit. event such as a flood, earthquake, or a hurricane that causes great damage. Or- I mean, that's a natural disaster. I don't, I don't mean, see that's about no stampede. Yeah, I wasn't. I couldn't. Stampede ain't no natural disaster, bro. Yeah, natural can't. disasters are. Ca- I, mean, kind of on, I don't see a yes or a no. With atmospheric, geological, and hydrological origins, droughts, earthquakes, floods, hurricanes, landslides. So it can't be biological. It's not looking well, it's like not. it's geological. It. All right, all right, we found the line. Well, since I won, I, since I won, I <laughs> want you to go. <laughs> since I won, this I called you a lie. I called you a lie. I'll set the terms. Since you lost, so you go ahead. I'm, no, I'll do some push-ups. Go ahead and do the push-ups. Oh, I'm not going to do these push-ups. <laughs> push-ups, push-ups. Right. Uh, nah, nigga, no, 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 no. I want some money. I'm broke. He says the same He says the same situation. <laughs> what we I won, though. I'll give you some 20. But he called it out. I did call it out. No, boy, how do you not know this? <laughs> I'm, just, I'm, I'm trying to get one over. <laughs> I know. <laughs> All right. We're going to pause right here for your push ups. Oh, we can. Uh... I mean, I gotta, we, can I, I, end, I, we can do it at the end of the segment. No, I just want to do them now. It's okay. Fine. Do it, do it, do it. I haven't worked out today. Go ahead, muscle milk. Sure. Go ahead, muscle milk. Go ahead, do your I thing. I will kill you. Yeah. It's funny because like he's white. Like... <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. Bro. <laughs> oh, yeah, I want to know right now. I'm going for niggas' heads. He's not two percent. Two, three, he's saying with two percent. Five, no, 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 white, six, seven, <laughs> not two, eight, oh, not two nine, nine, no, that's ten, ten crazy, nine, right no, oh, oh yeah, okay, not two percent, no, yeah, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, there go twenty. I'm oh, getting into all that shit, huh? Yeah, uh, all right, you showing out now, bro? Can nobody even see you, bro? I'm gonna stop it. I'm gonna stop it. I'm gonna stop it. I ain't gonna give him the glory. You all right? I think it's work out today. Keep on, we're gonna fuck around and call <laughs> push ups every time on Brian. <laughs> you wanna show out. I was say, Stampede, I don't know about no natural disaster. Yeah, I don't know if that's considered. Well, yeah, it's an invi- uh, unfortunate event, continue. though. Okay, but it happened, world. right? All right, that <laughs> happened. It did happen. Thoughts? While I kiss my breath? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there was a lot of, you know. Talking about uh, responsibility and culpability and, and who's really at fault and should Travis have done more to stop this mat And we just looked at the pictures of the massive crowds of people yeah. that was there. I don't know how much power you think this one man <laughs> oh. could really have 
uh, to stop this. And then, and then I was seeing a lot of other people sharing videos of other artists that have stopped their concerts to settle the crowd down. That bigger crowd, though? Or whatever. But no, and you didn't, I didn't see you anything. You can't see everything, right? Of this we magnitude. Got some goddamn binoculars. And it was the people right in front that they were able to see. Right. So why, that's why they stopped. Similar like with Travis Scott, maybe? Mm. Yeah, maybe. Because the show stopped for folks that was close. Mm hmm. He said, someone passed out. Say, hey, man, someone passed he out. He started to get them some help. Don't yeah. touch them. Let the med- medics get to them. But everybody act like he just said, fuck it. I don't care if people mm-hmm. getting hurt. Let's I'm up going. here dancing while people yeah. are dying mm-hmm. down there or something, you know? Well, uh, there was one particular He's dude. He's getting sued, too. There was, was heavy. <coughs> Hold on. Mm, him and Drake. There was one particular yeah, guy who, uh, right. I don't know, man. When you when you see traumatic experiences, some people connect it to, like, a, a higher thing that's happening when, really, you just need to see what's going happening around you. And, like, this one dude was like, yeah, he sacrificed so many lives. Like, he didn't sacrifice shit. It was 100,000 people in the area <laughs> that trampled each other. Right. And if you go back and you'll see the footage of him being like, hey, somebody passed out up here up front. Somebody come get this shit. Like, somebody handle this. Right. Like, he did, he did point that stuff out, so... But I'm telling you, he's not going to. That's know why that the I went on the natural disaster tip because when yeah, when something like that big is popping off and you're not prepared for it, it is a disaster. It's it's definitely a, a disaster, but not natural. Yeah, it's a, I think it's a line. Right. Definitely Damn a disaster. Near, close to it. Definitely I'm almost unavoidable. But they were they were talking about people were going around drugging people. I don't know. The police. Yeah, were yeah I don't know about the, that. The cops said that one of the security guards got. There's going to yeah, be drugs anyway. Drug, and then today he came in and retracted it and said it, it was that wasn't the case. So. No, so what happened though? I don't know. He said, I wow. felt the pinch on my neck. I don't know. And, oh, uh, that's what he said. Yeah, and they police people said that when they was invest- in, uh, investigated, he looked like he had a prick on his neck or something where he oh, was so stabbed with a needle. Yeah, okay. But I think drugs definitely played a part in it, too. No, and that, you know what? Hell For sure. yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Dude, most of the people, at, at least most of the people at the front was high for goddamn sure. Right on something probably on the weed too. They had to be right. So mm-hmm. so you got all these people is high energy, high numbers, high probably drug usage and distortion, yeah. and y'all and are don't discount them the the chemical reaction in the body. That shit will have you. But people are expecting them to make life saving yeah. decisions or have that process of thinking. To stop, stop breathing, stop running, focus on folks that's running, that's not going to happen. Well, it's, think it's, about yeah. this, though. Why doesn't that happen all the time? Because people plan for this shit, well, like and, this and they obviously this. didn't plan for that. Plan for that. Oh, yeah. yeah, no. Why aren't, people, why, aren't people, why aren't people always trampled at concerts? Why, when somebody has 100,000, 200,000 people in an arena, don't you hear about deaths? Because people plan for that shit. If you're planning to crowd everybody somewhere and get them all hyped up, you also got to plan for the worst. Mm-hmm. You can't. Two and, things. And they, didn't, I, they, they couldn't have done that. They couldn't have things. done that. I agree with you, Brian. One thing, yes, planning was terrible. It had to be terrible because they were severely undermanned mm-hmm. for any services for a crowd this big, period. Mm-hmm. Now, and I'm talking about the ones that were supposed to be <clears throat> Where's Not the at? ones that broke in was uh, that? Texas. Was it Texas? Yeah. I don't know. Was it Texas? I believe it was Texas. Uh-oh. Call it. Here we go. Again, is Somebody it? Somebody do it. Texas sound I right. can't. I can't. Yeah, probably, I can't. So. I don't don't really don't know. I, don't <laughs> I honestly don't. Astro, Astros. He's an Astros. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It takes the sound about right. Yeah, one thing, yes, the planning, the underplanning thing. Yeah, they so, should have more staff. You saying or more? Uh, more staff, more uh, security, security, whatever. Security. Uh, yeah, they probably had a few hundred security guards, and at the end of the day, they probably wasn't getting paid enough to try to stop a full on like Great, panic uh, attack from like hundreds of or even tens of thousands of people. I don't but even, the the problem hmm. started earlier in the fucking day though people were trampling each other to get inside knocking over fences to oh, this is all day in. right here yeah it's a festival it's a festival so the people weren't even so there were people that were already injured in the beginning of the day or earlier in the day wow. before the main you know catastrophe even right. happened mm-hmm. and to me <clears throat> if you can't if your perimeter can't be secured like that then you're definitely under man for and I'm only saying for a, si- or a concert this big or event this big mm-hmm. because this is apparently not the first time this group has had problems understaffing large events uh, oh the they, same group here they cutting yeah. corners in the right. budget because huh? he used a certain group to plan right. this thing well, mm-hmm. uh, so and they're not doing I, I a good job I don't I don't think I don't Apparent. think right. the, the second thing on the fucking 
uh, uh, sacrifice shit and all that stuff. Mm. I, and I, I hate that we live in a place where it seems like everybody is getting hit with the MIB memory eraser <laughs> thingy. <laughs> because since the beginning of time, concerts have incorporated all kind of things that you would consider dark, evil, scary, uh, demonic, mm. skulls, rituals, mm. all kind of shit. That has gone on at concerts since <clears throat> the beginning of yeah. public performance. It depends mm. on your artist, right? If yeah, they, I mean, if, but, if they're into that kind of yeah, thing. Yeah, I'm not saying every artist. Yeah. I'm saying the activity has been going so, on. So to this the this wasn't nothing new. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this wasn't nothing new for y'all. You didn't see the children sacrifice? Look at this image. And look at this image. Duh, stupid. That every fucking thing has a theme. <laughs> Dramatic song. So if that's the theme, you're going to see images that right. reflect that theme. Right. Mm-hmm. Now, oh, because some people died, Travis Scott sacrifices. No. You sound stupid, my Yeah, nigga. you really do. You really sound stupid. Right. I have performed on you stage. You went straight to superstition. In front of thousands of people. Immediately. And you could barely hear the people in the microphone when they telling you some shit. <laughs> and that's for performance. That's not discounting the music, the lights, the crowd itself making noise. You could barely hear what's right in your ear. But y'all all the way in the back think this nigga is orchestrating a sacrifice mm. of kids. A ritual. In the fucking mm. back of this concert. Mm. Come on, y'all sound stupid as hell. If you brought your kids there and they died, that's your fault. Yeah, that's I your don't fault. know why I mean, was well, yeah. The kids get there, because you gotta remember, like, this dude has had partnerships with McDonald's Kids Meals. Yep. He was all on Fortnite doing yep. performances, and these kids was rushing and selling out this man's stuff. So they, he has a he has a finger. The Fortnite gotta, thing alone probably what got him. My ten year old is not going to a Travis Scott concert. My ten year old is not going. No, he's not going. No, not going. Rap concert. Stop. Yeah, you're not going. Especially not one of this size. Right. No. Like yeah, like, really. Jesus Come on. Christ. My son is nine. He asked me to go to a concert. I'll be like, wait, who? Why? Where? Right. Is it right. Blues Clues? Yeah, I'd be scared. <laughs> <of these. laughs> like, yeah. You going to see the Wiggles? You can go to that. I'd be scared that one of these half a million people gonna steal my motherfucking son. I don't even care hell about fucking, the, the hell injury fucking thing. No. I'm like, what if somebody kidnapped my kid? No, There's thousands no. of people here. The way you're trafficking no. is. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Come on, I'm not yeah. even finna play. Mm, so wow. parents, you you bear some responsibility. Oh yeah, you definitely. Oh, oh, some. Oh, right. some. No, yeah. they're trying to yeah. because some? they're trying to right. sue they are Travis suing. Scott they are and suing. Drake. For for the fucking incidents for the somebody incident. you know somebody can rightfully sue them, but not the parents of ten year old children that was at that concert. Yeah, That's crazy. I don't think things. you can rightfully sue them. Travis Scott specifically. I think you can sue the the event planner. Yeah. I think you can sue them. I think you can sue unless the that's his facilities. company too as well. I don't think it's mm-hmm. his company. Well, when we fifteen in, what you want to? I mean, we more than that, but uh, fifteen usable. You know, let us know in the comments. Uh, we <laughs> we didn't really get that deep into it. A lot of details have come out. Yeah, we this is our first video on it, but like two, three from more prominent figures have you know gone gone in on several subjects for this stuff. And uh, I just want to know what do you guys think about this whole concert? How it popped off in uh, you know the environment in which it happened. You know, it, is this something that Travis Scott can be blamed for? It should him and Drake be sued or like is this just something that happens and that people need to be held accountable for do y'all like, think a little he bit should better? be sued Travis if, if you be, get COVID so? from this event should you be able to sue the motherfucker I think if you if you were neglectful in any way you that that somebody suing you on that is technically fine like if you was ne- if you, you were neglectful in any way, chances are you won't win. But I mean, you know, I think you have a right to sue if somebody was neglectful in any way in that <laughs> event. If you didn't plan it well, if you didn't set it up so that it was safe, if you didn't put any limits on it, you sold it out and let people crowd your shit. Encourage right. people to yeah. jump over fences. Yeah, right. like yeah. like that's you got to be held accountable well, well, to some degree. Okay, for that. wait, Chris, you to some said degree. that somebody else said that to Uh-oh, me online. When was he telling people to, to bust the fences and climb over the fences? I heard it was from his uh, previous oh, okay. concert that he okay. did. That, that's all I want to yeah. <laughs> You know, you can, mm-hmm. you can promote mm-hmm. like that, but then you have to set up security like that as well. So that while they're doing that, they that get their asses like clothesline. That was like years ago, though, or something. <laughs> okay. From what I understand. Anyway, yeah, we'll leave it at that. Know, let, right? let us know, man. Give us some more definitive answers here, because I don't think anybody Sorry, took a U.L.I. on this one. Did some, oh, you shut did. up. Come on. Oh, no! <laughs> Besides me. Besides me. (laughs) I knew that one. All right, yeah, we out. All right, right, second subject. uh, It is what it is. I ain't tripping, though. Dropped in the Discord earlier this week. I don't know if y'all been following this Kyle Rittenhouse uh, trial that's been going on. Um, If you are any... Who's the most familiar with why he's on trial. Not all right. of us. 
Uh-uh. All of us know the story. You know why Mark keeps saying no? Yeah, he knows the story, and once he once he realizes, I believe it was in Kenosha. Rehash it. Yeah, yeah, you're right. It is Kenosha. Rehash it. Yeah, white boy in Kenosha shows up. George Floyd. Uh, back when George Floyd was killed, there was the riots that happened out there. That long ago. That long ago. That happened in I believe Milwaukee or Minneapolis, something like that. I don't know exactly where. Something a black person would be in prison for life for right now. This man comes from 45 minutes out in a whole another city, whole another town. Comes to the Protest. I believe it was city. But, you know, get, okay. that, get down where you're mad. Scared. You just said, talking about you weren't scared. Uh, no, I didn't. You, you, were you, you know what? You came from all over the state, guys. Get down where you're mad at. I think he's right. I think it wasn't on the state. I don't. I'm not sure. I'm all not right. sure. All right. I'm on a shot, but I'm not sure. <laughs> I don't want to do. I don't want to look it up. Okay. <laughs> how, how, how do you? How do you, 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 you could probably find better on, uh, on you're Google right. and shit. You know. No, but, right. but that's that's uh, more or less what happened. He goes down yeah, there. Uh, uh, his life, he feels his life is threatened. He ends up shooting a couple people uh, as he was like laying on the ground. So it was from a different state. You were absolutely right, and I felt like that was right. Mm. Mm. You got to do something. <laughs> you got to do something. I caught a shot. Oh, well, there you go. You 17 when you did this? Yeah, you yes. Wow. So, so he was from a different state, but you're right. He was 17 years old when he did this, went out there, and his excuse for it was to protect businesses and the community from rioters or, you know, uh, the protesters that were protesting. In the community you don't even live in, but that's neither here in the community he Crazy. don't even live in. like me going to Delano doing some shit, dumb shit. <laughs> <Coming up, laughs> For real. Mm-hmm. Yeah, just showing up to do yeah. some stupid. Dumb shit. And then, and then, <laughs> no, hell fucking no. In, in all of this, he ends up taking two people's lives and injuring another one that's, uh, that was in the hospital for a while fighting for, his, fight, fighting for their own. Right. And, um, We've been watching pieces of the prosecution and stuff, and it seems like they're going, they're really going and may even have a strong case for self-defense on his behalf. The nigga who's not from this state, wow. who's not from this community, who came with a fucking uh, semi-automatic rifle mm-hmm. that he wanted to get before, already, before any of this, to come protect property that has no ties to him in a community that he does not belong. I mean, in a community the, he does not spend money. At all. He's yeah. the victim. To this county at of all. Self defi- uh, of uh, See, of no. aggression to claim self-defense. And it seems like he may get off with it. So, and I've dropped clips. Y'all Jeez. seen all the judges mm-hmm. shit was going? What y'all think about this? More? Like like Brian said, man, if it was a, a brother doing this nonsense, they wouldn't even had it. Bro, he dead. You guess. Bro wouldn't right. have made it from the riots, man. Yeah. Oh yeah. He wouldn't have made it from the Yeah, when he riots. got this far. No, because remember after after when he did it, he walked towards the police with his motherfucking gun still. Mm. It wasn't on his back, it was in his arms, and they gave him water. Yeah, they talked they to him. Hey, water. buddy, how you doing? Him. Hey, you should get out of here, you know. It's not safe right now. And that's the big thing right there, what Brian's oh, pointing out. I know Everybody that. probably seen the viral. Uh, clip of him it's fake crime. testifying, uh, yeah, and <laughs> yeah, LeBron's like, man, what fake doing yeah, all that kind of stuff? Here. And I look behind me, yeah. there was a two people uh, like this nigga here is putting on, and I think you know you've heard the stories and the people not showing enough uh, remorse in the, in the courtroom. That's all he was trying to do right there, mm-hmm. trying to look like he had time. To Make it look good, but he, it wasn't. You look, look worse, bro. Yeah, your, your motivation from going there doesn't match. The, the if, if these were real tears, let's, let's give them the benefit of the doubt and say they're real tears. Mm-hmm. Your reasoning for going there doesn't match this kind of guilt that you're feeling. Like no, you thought all. these were, people were doing wrong. You thought you were in the right, right, morally, and that you came there and you did what was supposed to happen to protect the community, right? You wouldn't have been up here like, oh my god, I was so traumatic and blah blah blah. Oh blah, my blah. god, you know, come on, man. Like this, the whole the whole show is for the birds. It is for me. the birds. Mm-hmm. The judge has been being impartial. Uh, not impartial. He's been has been being very partial towards him, towards like you at moments like he feels sorry, like like sorry for himself. Sympathetic him towards mm-hmm. him, mm-hmm. making excuses for his actions, his actions and mm-hmm. his his train of thought That's great. before this, before really focusing on the real uh, fact behind the trial, which was the nigga was not supposed actions. to be there, mm-hmm. and now people are dead. Yeah, all of that is being ignored and kept out of the case. A lot of shit that backs that up is being kept out of the case, Correct. so they can focus on. 
him saying I was being hit in the head and somebody hit me with a skateboard. Mm-hmm. So I feared for my life and I shot them in self-defense. But what was telling to me was the, him saying, the judge that is, saying that he's not going to allow him to to call people that were shot victims. That that told me all I need to know about how this was going to go. Wow. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, like, you just said that. If yes. two people that, get, that were killed aren't victims, I don't know who, who is. Man, this trial is for this nigga then. Right. Right, he's gonna get off by right. just saying some dumb shit like this. I think he's gonna get off because they're saying that he has video evidence because people who are recording things shows that people were beating him up. Yes, hmm. people were beating him up because you walked to a group of people protesting hmm. that were mostly were unarmed hmm. with a loaded motherfucking rifle. Hmm. Yes, nigga, it's weird to me. Did, it's he, so did, y'all, did y'all see the the one of a uh, dude that was on the the freeway and he was pulling out? He got out with a bow and arrow. No, no, and he was yes. shooting people with a bow and arrow that. on the highway. Yes, wow, that. but then niggas mobbed on him and put hands and on his man. Yes, and, and he and he and he went to jail. Yes. The so dude I with wonder, the bow and arrow. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. See, so yeah, I, I yeah. wonder what makes that one different than this right. one. Right, because the, the bow and arrow, he was already doing that and at, already doing that before do, they uh, became a, a dactyl. So he they said, oh, he's he saw the yeah. He saw okay. he saw okay. first, then they came over to beat his ass. Then they came over to beat his ass. I can even give you that, Maury, but check this out. That's why they have that's what I'm saying. Now if you frame it more practically how it probably went down, you have this dude, lone white dude with this gun, walking towards a group of unarmed people with his gun in his motherfucking hands towards them. He doesn't look like he's there to protest with mm-hmm. us. In mm-hmm. fact, he's there to do the opposite. Mm-hmm. So you telling me that these people don't have a right to fear for their lives yeah, yes, with do. you walking up ready to shoot motherfuckers right. over shit that you don't have no tie to. Not your city, now, not your jurisdiction. You're jur- the jur- victim. Count nothing. I, I can't. I, I, I can't. They, I, can, I, they can only see that tie. They can only see from the perspective they, of the 17-year-old. And they're only trying board. to see from they're that. Only see. From they're only trying to see. I don't think they have the capabilities because they, they already don't think the protests were justified. Right. Right. So if you're coming from that perspective, yeah. you don't even think that right. they had no reason right. to be there. Right. Right. You don't see why it was wrong for mm. a black man to be killed and mm. knee on his it's neck funny. at 46. Like, what's the difference? Uh, what's the difference between a, a 16, 17 year old boy walking up with a assault rifle and a 35 year old man, a grown black man, walking around with a assault rifle? Like what's well, the difference? Are gonna get well, shot well, on yeah, we well, complexion? yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, let's just <clears throat> let's just talk Forces about it. Like, here. like what would have happened? What would have been the reaction in the crowd? I think the reaction in the crowd was was uh, you know that was what you do. Like if somebody showed up with a loaded fucking weapon, you probably want to try to disarm them or something mm. like that. Mm. But like uh, it wouldn't even got to it wouldn't even got to that point if it was a black dude. Like it wouldn't, oh, he wouldn't have yeah, been able yeah, to walk yeah, away yeah. from shooting people past the cops. He couldn't have got no. the water. Couldn't have done that. No, 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 no he'd be dead right now. Yeah. He would have been executed yeah. on the spot. He would yeah. have been executed on the spot. We wouldn't have called it execu- execution. He would have been caught and or whatever. Whatever mm. the story would have been, he would have ended up dead with, in a showdown with the cops. But mm-hmm. there would have been no trial. Right. We would not have known. We right. might have known this person's name, mm. but we talking about a seventeen year old white boy here who is getting the <laughs> fucking go on. Onto TV and do this terrible, terrible job at acting. First of yeah. all, like yeah. like one of first the worst things foremost. you've ever seen. Like I've seen people try to cry before. And right. Damn, brother. And like, who coached you up on this? <laughs> yeah. 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 Like someone told man, go in there and fake cry, man. You gonna get off? This like there's, there's, man, there's, not like that, man. Damn, what you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, God, like, damn it. like if I was a judge, I would have gave him life for that fucking acting. <laughs> 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 I would immediately, I'm like, yo, well, ass man, is get the fuck out my goddamn courtroom, nigga. Yeah. Right. You know, man, get your ass off. You get butt raped for life. Yeah. <laughs> like for real. They got, they got a certain amount of sympathy nah, for, for their kind. You remember yeah. the, Sherman brought it up when we was uh the mm-hmm. other day when we was talking. But about the dude that raped that With girl the behind the, uh yeah. yeah, behind a dumpster and he had such a bright future and all that was stuff. That the barrier? They having the barrier? No? Mm-mm. That was somewhere else. That wasn't Stanford. Wait, was it Stanford? I know nothing about this and will not participate. <laughs> Let me stop was. getting off the phone. <laughs> <laughs> I'm yeah, really, I heard something like I that. I mean, no rapping chair. I don't know if it was. I don't know if it was. I want to say it was Stanford, mm-hmm. which, which is which is Silicon Valley, right? Could it be? It could have been. I don't know. Whatever. But Where's, it, 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 whatever. I think so. But yeah, yeah. no, you you're right. You're absolutely right, Chris. We've seen them time and time again try kids as young as 14 as adults and yeah. uh, uh, separate cases that are harder to even prove. Mm. Uh, um, but no, none of that is considered The bright future is not considered His age is not considered They look at young black men And say And see animals yeah. See mm-hmm. grown for their age Or yeah. more violent This right. is what they the do motherfuckers Who are actually out here Doing violent 
shit. Yeah. The judge sympathized with him as a kid, mm. but if he was any shade of brown, not even just black, you don't even any see him shade as a of kid. brown, you don't see him he would have been there. tried as a motherfucking adult, again, who had an illegal firearm. You're not even old enough to buy a firearm legally, let alone an illegal one. So, how we get past that? I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. How we get past that? Shit. That hasn't no even been mentioned. Idea. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's a good right. point, though. That's a good point. I have no idea how we yeah. even get past <laughs> that's that. That's like me coming from, from Vegas. Got this heavy artillery to come to Vegas on some dumb shit. On some right. dumb shit. Doing some stupid shit. shit. No, no, Cali. Right. Oh. We be mourning you right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we, we, yeah. you heard yeah. something was happening. Yeah. 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 I heard it was going down over yeah. there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Easy. <laughs> People think that it's an open and closed That's case right. because of the self-defense claim. But to me, it's an open and closed case before, oh. for a different reason. Is he going to try it as a minor? Most likely. He's 17. Oh, yeah. He's he's gotta gotta minor minor. Minor. It's all about age, right? That's the technical. I mean, but I mean, some instances they might charge him as an adult, though. But yeah, that's true. Then again, I, I don't know. They they like, they like, all the sympathy. Like, if he was black, not. he'd be tried as an adult, for sure. Right, but it's a lot of sympathy. That's why representation <laughs> matters, what man. What shade is his skin? You in there with a bunch of old white men, and mo- you probably pink? look at the judge list and see that most of them are. White, pink, beige, whatever call it, you want to call it. Pink. Yeah. <laughs> they, they, they yeah. end up lacking pigmentation. What texture is his hair? Is you know it smooth saying? or is it curly? We need more black judges. Look, put that nigga in jail. <laughs> 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 yeah. 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 I am willing to put money yeah. on that on uh, that yeah. mind. Oh uh, boy. Oh, yeah. I'm willing yeah. to put money yeah. on the fact boy. that a lot of the shit that he you got a little tar on the brush, you ain't one of them. In this, in this case, a lot of shit that has not been allowed in this case. The judge said that he has allowed certain. Evidence like that before in But other if your cases, name is Javante, I guarantee you mm-hmm. those the niggas who he allowed that type of shit Jartavis. in the case yeah. for. Mm-hmm. He was mad that the prosecutor tried to bring up this man's past, like his record. Like saying it had nothing to do with now. Why are you bringing up the past and shit? But this is what y'all do to us all the time. The Context victims, matters. Mm-hmm. The victims, you will pull up the criminal history mm-hmm. of a dead nigga yep. and ignore oh, the uh, criminal uh, history uh, of the murder. Yeah, they'll ask me who my daddy was if I was in, like they'll ask me like nigga, I don't that's my dad. What, what, what you want? What you want me to do? <laughs> I, just, I don't. I don't. It's it's hard what? to watch it. It's What's hard to watch it, and it be What's just moving? accepted. Audio. Oh no, it's fine. You good? You just got that thing up. It's hard to be accepted as a norm like this. You just that. have to accept this shit as it is. It's just how the system works. It's just, but we don't have no representation yeah. in there. I mean, that's, you nobody know. to look at us we, as seventeen. Give us right. enough time. We'll be Russia. Right. <laughs> <laughs> like, give me a dollar. I'll do whatever uh, the fuck uh, you want. Uh, <laughs> 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 just give us enough time. We'll yeah, get where there. Where all these so called ga- oh, uh, gangsters at? You feel me? Like, what? somebody need to go touch this nigga, man. We might. We might all have to go back to Africa. I'm concerned. How Zimmerman? Still walking around like how ain't all these so called gangs? Where y'all at, gangsters? Yeah. Like what the fuck, gang? Man, that nigga should not be living right now. He probably in witness that, protection. To be real with right? you, his oh, probably his name be. probably ain't even Zimmerman. Y'all, no y'all, y'all, y'all press a nigga for twenty dollars. Miserman. I bet you yeah. Yeah. Kyle Rittenhouse <laughs> gets off. Yeah. Yeah. Walk, his ass better go. Yeah, you better go to witness protection because his ass gone too. I mean, neighbors was six nine. Yeah. For yeah. real, for real. Yeah, social justice is a real thing. It's gonna have to be because the real social justice, justice warrior. Keep failing us. <laughs> These niggas yeah. like, yeah, I'm gonna take care of you today. If he's failing, right. then eventually we're somebody gonna, gonna have come to get you. Social yeah. justice. It's gonna have to be street justice. Somebody street hey, justice. That's what it comes to a lot of times. Because there's no way you will not. Like, that's why we got witness protection. Niggas, don't, niggas don't do that shit with, with, with in these matters. No. Oh, when we need, when we need it, right. when we need to win, not to say we need somebody to die, but you know, we're not here. This gotta call. To action. That's kind of where we yeah, yeah, oh, please don't think we're. <laughs> but I think consequences. I think we consequences need to occur from shit like that, right? Right. When you could, like I said, well, you could press a dude for twenty dollars, and people like this that then did some real wrong to the community is walking around. We got a real flawed way of thinking. Yeah. And that's, it's, that's, it's kind of reflective of yeah. our own justice yeah. Yeah. You system, can, you, though. You can pop one dude for sleeping with your girl, but, right. like, you right. know, right. You, right. you listen to a white dude. No. no. Like, right. no. Zimmerman no. going on tour sell, signing Skittle bags and shit. Like, dude, wild. <laughs> dude is wild. That is crazy. <laughs> anyway. Dude, but probably hey, because, <laughs> here we go, probably because the niggas know that they will receive harsher consequences for retaliating in that aspect than this nigga. Oh, we all know that. In the first place. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. most of us are scared to go up against the system. And that's the, the bottom line. Most of us and that's the bottom line. against the system. And, and, and the fear is there. We know we'll be slaves real. again when the they system, go back. Oh, no, yeah. it's real. And it's, 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 it's understandable. I understand it all. Niggas ain't trying to be slaves for nobody. I yeah. know. It's built to slap you down, though. Right. 
But it stops us from doing exactly what we're talking about, though, because niggas ain't. Do we know we don't stand a chance? We not gonna get up there and the judge be like, this nope, thing, because he's no he's sympathy, no he yeah. needs to get himself together. No, nope. no, hell, the black judge gave the white bitch a hug after and the a Bible and a Bible and a Bible. Mm. <laughs> she probably ain't never hugged a black fucking defendant. And threw like that she Bible had. in the trash on the way out the courthouse. I mean, there's no footage of her. Don't need that no more. <laughs> so that's what I do. <laughs> like I uh, got his ass. <laughs> gotcha. For real. <laughs> For real. She got off. Oh, <laughs> I'll be out in two and a half years. Thank you, man. What, what you want in the in the comments, there? For real, man. Uh, I just want y'all. I, I, I want a couple of things. I want y'all to know, man. Do this nigga deserve to be locked the hell up, or do you believe in his self defense claim? <laughs> and two, how the hell? I just want my help to understand. How do we get past him having this legal gun and being in a different state? All right. Period. That's that's number one right there. How he able to get this number in the first place? Somebody that knows something about the law explains to me how. How do we get there? Put it in the comments. Put it it in the comments. comments. Get up out of there. Yeah, we just, there should be a lot of gigs going go. on here. Here we go. Next topic and final topic of the night. So, oh, uh, wow. like, like I said, too, right? we was talking about uh, mm-hmm. uh, topics earlier and what potential ones may be. And I, I brought up something I heard on uh, Damn Internet, You Scary, a uh, podcast that I watch. This was uh, scary. <laughs> and it's about male yeah. contraceptive. Yeah. It's interesting. We got yeah, episode yeah. 69 yeah. and all that stuff <laughs> like that. Damn, this was scary. We got a four brothers, four males up here in, in particular. So Very mature males at that. This, <laughs> this uh, and, and they read the article. I didn't, I didn't read uh, the article yeah. recently, but more or less, there's this liquid <laughs> that you stick your balls in. No, yeah. it's not the liquid. Liquid. It was the well, liquid. Call him out. Call him out. Oh, no, we can't because I already lost to you a lot. Okay, it's not the liquid that you stick your balls in. It's the it's the, the process that your balls go through therein afterwards. The ultrasonic so, you balls treatment. Liquid, so ain't no liquid involved it's at all. It's an ultrasonic treatment. Ain't no liquid involved at all. I mean, maybe. I don't know. I swear to God, it was sticking your balls. Well, somebody like, somebody said something. Damn. Nigga, you are a lot of Damn. 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 You don't stick your balls in liquid and just wait. What were we supposed to do? Sherman, remember? Uh, yeah, you, want me, you want me to read it? Sherman, you remember? Wait, uh, uh, Sherman, I still got the article. Okay, go ahead. For the shot, then. Fine. Yeah. It's fine. Sheesh. Whatever. Whatever. Another shot. Uh, that mean, another that shot? means I might have to do a double shot. Wait, I'm going to put one of these one down. There we go. Just so, in case. Go ahead, frame it, Chris. Keep it up. Keep going. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I'm, I'm, uh, no, 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 no. Like Chris, like, that's all I got. <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's a testicular ultrasonic bath. And I'm finna. That's no one see that. Pause. What's that you were saying? A, a bath, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> bath. You got your whole bath for this? The nuts to thing. use this baby blocking <laughs> bidet, the bather simply adds the water up to the indicated mark, which uh-huh. is set together, doctor. Mm-hmm. After heating the water up to the requisite temperature, mm-hmm. the man spreads his legs mm-hmm. and sits down to place his testicles mm-hmm. in the device. <laughs> so you gotta dip your balls, tea bag style, or as I have else in some warm liquid. You tea bag your way. To Come on. The <laughs> okay, what does it do for you though? Is that supposed to be? So you put your, your your balls in this water for however many minutes. No, I won't. No. no. And it's oh, hell no, okay. I'm not. So this for six months, does. for six oh, months, you can't have a baby. I'm going to answer it. I'm going to answer it accurately. All right, comment. Which one anyway? Go ahead. Go ahead. Oh. It says, this kickstarts... Uh, Coso's prophylactic process, which works by employing ultrasound deep heat for several minutes to temporarily halt sperm mo- t- mobility to the testicles, oh, effectively yeah. preventing swimmers from fertilizing the female egg. You're boiling the sperm away. Yeah, you boiling. <laughs> okay, you're, cooking, you're, cooking, you're, cooking, you're cooking your balls. It's, it's you're cooking, post balls. You're cooking <laughs> your kids. You just poked them a little kids. bit. So I can fuck a bitch nut on her. And nut I, all, I, but I, shoot the club up. And it all. <laughs> Shoot that. Don't you never tell me to put my nuts in something and boil my eggs, nigga. I will never do that shit. For six oh, months of fun? You yeah, just you got put no both eggs, of them in the hell fucking no hell. I'm just saying, my huevos, you know. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Call me queso, huh? Nigga, <laughs> you'll be shooting more blanks than Alec Baldwin guns. Uh, uh, yeah, I guess, uh, man. Uh, well, if you be shooting anything, you be shooting uh, like, uh, like steaks. Right. <laughs> yeah, Alec Baldwin out here doing his thing. Scrambled eggs and shit, man. All your scrambled cooked, nigga. 
like, well, I don't know what. I don't know what that looks like. Hell no, man. That don't, that don't sound right. Uh, how, is it, how long you got to put your balls in the thing? Uh, several minutes. Several, several minutes. Several minutes. Six <laughs> minutes of, of ball of ball warm. Six minutes. I thought seven was like two to three. No, no I was thinking like five, that's minutes, five to six. Fucking that's right. a couple minutes Easy, to me. No, that's a couple answer. minutes, two, three, seven minutes over five. I would think. But I don't I, think anybody understands the horrifying nature of letting your balls be placed in any device to be done anything to. Like, no man. A warm water? You put it in the bath before, ain't you? <laughs> yeah, but the bath ain't yeah, killing my kids. A little, a little warm water. <laughs> yeah, if you got into the bath, I said, let me spread my legs and put them in. <laughs> Not first, but when I get in that motherfucker, I open it. <laughs> you like that? Why are you getting in there? Nah, bro, you gotta put your nuts in your ultrasonic device, man. <laughs> you go oh, put a vibrator on your balls in the back. Hey. I'm worried about, I'll be more worried about testicular cancer. That's a, oh, yeah. No, I'm sorry. That's do, something. Do yeah, I'm not doing that. Damn near radiating uh, my nuts. Damn near no, radiating no, I'm not doing that. And if you're doing something that stops my swimmers from swimming for the six months, Ultrasound sounds safe, but no, I thank don't. You. Yeah. Yeah. If, it, if it was safe from cancer, None of y'all doing it? I'm no. not doing it at all. I though. just feel like nobody. I, I think uh, psychologically I'll be crazy. fucked up. I'll be like, I think I just kicked. You wear a condom. I, I just do that. cook. Thank you. Yeah. you know a condom is different. I'll be like, I just cook my you testicles. Condom. You know a condom I'm is not, different. I'm not cooking yeah, my balls. Yeah, but so is cooking your balls. Yeah, I'm yeah, not cooking my balls. You ain't got to wear a condom. I'll go on now. I'm saying. Is that going to be the new lingo? Did you cook? Did you cook tonight? Yeah, girl. I'm a little overheated today. I only got it in three minutes, so we be rolling the dice. I'm not doing that. Bro. Did you? Come I'm wearing the condom, bro. For surely. Yeah, come on. Yeah, I'll, I'll get that. I'll get it. Oh, I'd uh, do it, bro. Yeah. I'd do it. Yeah, you can't Fuck plug that. up the volcano, but if, you can if put cancer was off the it. table, I'd give it a go. Oh yeah. my god. How hot got the water gotta be? Or the water sounds, the fuck it is? That's too much. I don't for think me. it's like gonna kill me. It ain't scalding hot. Oh, oh just no. warm. That's what I understood. But you don't know what, what, Listen, what's man. stopping your kids from swimming. I took the vaccine. You can go and cook your balls. <laughs> Let us know how this went. <laughs> what's stopping your kids from swimming? That. Do you know what's actually stopping them from, from, from stopping you from producing sperm? The technology like, you buy. Is it backing that shit up? Is it just storing it somewhere else in your what, what does that even fucking look like? Uh, yeah, for me, what I understand is it's like preventing it from doing what it's supposed to do for a while. Like whatever organ is generating whatever you need to get healthy sperm is temporarily being blocked. Oh, God. I, ultrasonic water? I'm getting sick to my months. stomach just <laughs> listening to me talking about this shit. I don't know what that would and, do and to me. And according to the article, it takes two weeks afterwards before you, you can get busy. Now, now, that's a drawback. I gotta wait two weeks? No, it's you ain't gotta wait two weeks, but in two like weeks you, you can still you get bitches pregnant. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's what I mean. That's what you I mean. get a vasectomy, you can't immediately go out and start fucking. Yeah, I don't want no vasectomy. No, I'm cool off that. I'm just saying, though. Like, hey, no, I don't want one either, right? That's why you do, like the episode say, you stick to 69 and you ain't gotta worry about contraceptive. Alright, so let's get into the 69. Now, is this a practical sex position while we talking about it? Alright, y'all. Shit, man. Been another episode of You Alive. You Alive. We talked about, uh, you know, uh, Kyle Bullshitter. Yeah. Because he don't deserve it. Kyle Shitting House. Yeah, we, call, we, we talked about that dude and the, the trial going on right now. It's fake crying and shit. Yeah. I was tears. That was... If he gets off, I don't know what to say. But, whatever. Yeah. The, we talked about Astro World. We talked about the Travis Scott uh, Travis, Festival. Yeah. Right there having the Houston man, the nine people that, that passed away. Rest in peace to them. Yeah. That shit was crazy. Right, we got every week we got somebody that we talking about some rest in peace, man. Wow. The last two weeks for sure. Man. We should come back and touch on an update on that uh, lawsuit, yeah. too, because uh, I still want to know why Drake oh, getting sued. Yeah, I seen that. It was a feature. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay. more, more will come out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's, it's not Definitely over. Definitely before the year, probably, yeah. Then we talk about uh, the sperm killer, you know. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. You know, Mail shit, uh, the male birth control, yeah. man. Yeah. Put your balls in. Give it a bath. You give, you, give your balls a bath. A warm bath for <laughs> several minutes. An ultrasonic bath. <laughs> several minutes, man. I, I wish I shit. would. Six, oh, yeah, I wish I did. Six know, months, though, you know, you're no, out no, here. No, that's what they said. We're going to zap your nuts dry for six months. I, 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 I wouldn't wear a condom. <laughs> I, I, give me a condom. I'm not doing that. Bro, they got that barely skin condom. Yeah, yeah, I got some. Barely skin. The bare skins? Yeah, they work at them. Yeah. Those are fine. It worked too. Yeah, it worked. Yeah, yeah. 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 You, you, you feeling it? Yeah, you, you, you feel allergic to latex. You allergic to latex? Oh, that's different. You gotta yeah. get the lamb skin. Lamb skin. Man, well, whatever you got, whatever you, you gotta, gotta do, man. Whatever, whatever you gotta do, man. Before you stick it. <laughs> <laughs> this dude, this dude. You got to do hot. Before you munch it. <laughs> 
these niggas is wild. Yeah, I mean, but it is episode 69, y'all, so that's why we... It's right on brand. That's yeah, why we on some bullshit-ish. Right. <laughs> the last topic. Yeah, and really immature with that. Uh, we said, tonight, Ray, we're yeah. going, we're very mature now. Yeah, we got IMX up here. Stop it. Yeah. <laughs> Kids don't watch it. It got bad. Yeah, Chris didn't even wake up till we started talking about fucking. <laughs> <laughs> we talking about fucking? You talking about pussy? I know about time. time. About that time. God damn it. About time. time. <laughs> but now the real note, man, we appreciate everyone been liking, downloading, subscribing, man, watching our videos, listening to the audio, yes, thank man. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Uh, order from the 805ENT.com, man. Get our merch on there for mm-hmm. sure. We're going to have some uh, holiday uh, oh, merch got, coming. We ain't got yeah, merch, yeah, yeah. We working on it. We working on it, man. Yeah, we're going to get the holiday Christmas season going with the merch, man. Definitely sure look out for that on the on the on the website for sure. 805 ENT.com. Yeah, man. Buzzsprout, YouTube, IG, Facebook, uh, yeah. iTunes. That's 805 ENT.com. All audio yeah, all, platforms yeah. over hey, there. Hey, hey, YouTube.com slash C slash. Give us that Levine. review on the iTunes too. That goes mm-hmm. a long way. I'll say that in a minute. But yeah. Yes. Give us yeah, that yeah, review. Sure. Yeah, for everybody who's giving us a review on review it. iTunes, mm-hmm. yeah. Uh, we got hundred percent five stars right now. So yeah. Woo! Keep it going. Be in the game. Yeah, sport. Yeah. Tell us how you feel. That's what we're saying. How you really feel. Yeah. And remember again to like and subscribe and share these videos, these conversations, man. With mm-hmm. your yeah. All yeah. we doing is having conversations. Join the it's conversation fun. with us. Yeah, and the people who listen on audio, you're more than welcome to have your input on mm-hmm. Discord, man. We yeah, drop right. a link for you all the time, yes. man. You guys can, you don't even got to interact with us, with us that much. If you want to drop an article, we'll be yeah. like, hmm. Just be that's like, cool. did y'all see that? Yeah. Did yeah, y'all yeah, see sure. this? Right. Yeah. If you're listening and y'all want an input, it is available in the description below. You don't got to converse with us, but if you want to drop a video, um, we want to see it We're here for oh, the engagement yeah, sure. yeah, yeah, we are yes, sir, yes, sir. For sure, for sure But you can catch me on uh, Snap Josh underscore Will 15 mm-hmm. My IG J underscore Will R6 That's where you can find me at, man Sharon, we can find you at, bro Oh, my social media At Sir D's Because I'm your favorite pothead mm-hmm. yeah, 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 I'm on uh, yeah. I'm on? Oh, Facebook oh, no. <laughs> Instagram Snapchat Twitter. Space Hey <laughs> Space Hey <laughs> Hey Space <laughs> 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 Stupid. But yeah, you can find me on all of that stuff, man. I'm on there acting a the fool, responding, Act dropping fool. memes. I'm a meme magnet, nigga. I find them, I drop them, I make them, I drop them. So, you know, okay, follow okay. your boy. <laughs> Shit, Chris, where we can find you at, bro? You can find me in St. Louis rolling on that. Uh, you a <laughs> You ain't rolling on St. Louis, nigga. That's a shot. <laughs> Uh, Instagram, that's C Boy Designs, all your graphic needs, web designs, you rockers, them all, too. all that. Mm-hmm. Yes, yes, mm-hmm. logos, the whole get down. Hit me up, we DM me, we can talk about whatever we need to. That's C Boy Designs Instagram. Mm-hmm. All right, man, Brian, we can find you at, bro. Uh, troll me, I'd be Dana 24. You can me. <laughs> no, you can troll me. You can troll, you can troll me. me. At B Dana 24. <laughs> yeah, that's a good one. <laughs> <laughs> But, uh, yeah, you can troll me right there if, you know, I, I might pay attention. I might not. No, I will. <laughs> but uh, if you don't, uh, I've been streaming on uh, Mind of Cal. Uh, mm-hmm. uh, that's what I use most of the time. Your Gamma Nama Slama for it's anybody who's been watching them. and knows mm-hmm. that bad one uh, for Twitch, whatever. You didn't drop those. Sorry, that was that was a bad drop, but you'll fix, you'll fix it. And then, uh, <laughs> wait, one more thing. Oh, well, I am slime on work, Instagram, but I'm just on. No, 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 no. no I'm on Instagram, but I am the ULI podcast right now on Instagram. Instagram. So, like, I see, I see all that shit. I see everything that's dropped on Instagram. I, I'm definitely plugged in on that. So, if you want to contact me or the rest of these guys, you can do the Instagram thing, which I really don't know what the handle is. Actually, you, you is it you underscore lie, lie under you a underscore lie underscore podcast mm-hmm. right mm-hmm. on Instagram? So, yeah, I don't know. We'll pay. It, it'll be there. The graphics will be there. And slight work on Snapchat. Since oh, yeah. I said, yeah, yeah, slight, slight work. work. Yeah, yeah it's right work. there. So, yeah, that's me. Sorry, I got a bunch of handles now. I went from one to man. Sorry. I'm trying. Thing. I'm trying, guys. Making effort. But shit, y'all been another episode of You Alive. If you you alive. alive. Catch y'all next week and we out. And we out. Now look at Morgan, man. Wrapping this shit up real quick. <laughs>